Good afternoon. The water's been looking pretty spectacular. So Surf Club finished at lunchtime and we raced home, grabbed the boat and we raced out. The wind kind of swung sore and northerly, but just have a look at this. So the anchor's in, we're just going to let it drop back a bit. Keep the motor running while the anchor drops back just to make sure everything's okay. But have a look at this, absolutely spectacular. Um, I don't know how well you can see that. What we're going to do is while the wind's still light, I'm going to get some stuff sorted out, get some rods rigged up, and Lee's going to chuck the drone up and give us a bit of a look at what it's... Give you a bit of a look from the air while it's all nice and clear, but this is... I've got the 90 mil shiver stick on the 30 pound outfit. Got the Daiwa TD Soul from Southside Boating and Fishing. Fished on the Daiwa Zero, beautiful 30 pound combo. Lee's got the 50 pound this time. Lee's got the 50 pound. He's got the Daiwa BG. Uh, I think it's a Shimano T curve rod. Not really a casting rod, more a jigging rod, but that's what we've got. And Lee's got the bigger shiver stick. He's got the 125, it's a bit heavier. There it is there. Um, after he got smoked the other day, he wanted to go a bit heavier, so he's gone to 50. I'm going to take my chances on 30. I'm just going to lock up and go hard. So we just repositioned and come in even closer in here. Um, there's no swell today, otherwise I wouldn't be in here. If there's any kind of swell, you just can't even get close to this place. It's so shallow through here. And they come right over the top of this platform. You just gotta be really careful and really know what you're doing before you start fishing these sort of areas, guys. Is that a big stingray there, Lee? Yeah, I was looking at that before. I think there's a big stingray just over there. But wow, how spectacular. Now, if we can just get the kings fired up, we'll be laughing. Let's have a look at this. At least just nabbed the skippy on a stick bait. <laughs> 125 mil stick bait. Oh, this skippy's come in and given it to him. Oh, he just skull dragged him. Oh. He's gone. Wow. We might keep him. Keep him. We'll eat him up later on, I think. I have a pretty clear vision of the lure. Oh my god, as soon as he hits the water, they're just like, wow, smash Put something bigger on. Oh. Can I go the bigger stick bait, one of your new ones? Yeah. The herring. Oh, this one's just. So we haven't had any joy in there. So we're just going to move around a bit off the, off to one side, around the side here, and see if we can safely anchor up over here somewhere. Wow, the water's so clear. It looks spectacular. Have a look at it. Oh, there's a herring. Oh, that's a big one. I don't really care if we catch or not when it's this nice. Where you go that way, man. You kind of milking it. That was a big hit. Was that? I caught that on footage. That was a big hit. Did you see that? Yeah. I was I looking. Lost my lure. You lost your lure? Oh, I just got snipped off. Right off. I, wow. I got that on footage. I was looking at you. Well, we've pretty much just given up on fishing now. The wind's kind of sort of slightly westerly and we're going to get out of here soon before it blows full southwest. But in the meantime, we're just going to have a quick swim. Beautiful, eh?
dolphins just over here. Oh, he's coming over. He's turned around. They're coming. They're coming. Oh, mate, get him! Get him! Oh, I love him. Come on. today we didn't get the king on i got one good bump it got bitten off real fast um, i'm not sure it could have been something with teeth that just bit me off as well whatever it was it was a decent hit but yeah no kings we thought we saw some we got a heap of herring but we don't really care just have a look where we are absolutely spectacular we've had a swim the breeze is just starting to whip so we got to run now before it gets too ugly so we get a nice run home so if you like our stuff Stay tuned and we'll see you in the next episode. Yeah.